today's workout is going to be it's going to start with a general warm-up we go through some mobility then a little bit of a harder or more specific warm-up okay and then mech on and if you have time we can stay for some accessory work which hopefully we will we all will but anyway we'll see when we get there so the first uh, part of the warm-up the general warm-up is um, three rounds of 60 seconds so one minute one full minute of uh, says machine or single unders but we can actually do if you have a skipping rope i'm fine you can do um, you can do singles it's normal skipping otherwise what we can do is the usual little cardio exercises so we can be jumping jacks okay. you can choose to do perhaps um running on the spot okay so if i destroy everything okay. running where you are or you can do in flicks, so that's for 60 seconds. Then it's meant to be 25 feet bear crawl. I don't know if we all have a garden and so on. So what we do is just keep it on the minute. So for a minute, what we do, we go into a five position, which is the start of a bear crawl. And what we do, if you can walk, just go up and down slowly. Okay. If you cannot walk, if you don't have an actual space to do it, what you can do is just Tap in your shoulders, okay, and try to keep as much body weight as possible on your hands. And the last minute, what we do is 20 seconds of side plank on one on one side, 20 seconds on the other side, and a little bit of rest so that we go into the next half. So, ready for your cardio exercise. We're going in sets of three minutes. Starting on 10 seconds. Ready? Two, one, and go. Running on the spot. Do. If you do some jogging, don't let your knees come up this way, okay? So keep them straight up in front of your, uh, of your body and use your hands as well. You can move it to jumping jacks. As long as we get the heart rate up for the first minute, try not to stop whichever option you're going for. Right until the end of the minute, guys. Ten seconds, and then we go in bear crawl. Three, two, one, down into bear crawl for the minute. Okay, a few steps. You can actually do uh, some lens, spine, bum up, straight leg or as straight as possible. And if you cannot do it, just tap your shoulders. Okay. Almost like seeing you walking forward each time. Keep moving. Come up. Okay. We start with 20 seconds of side plank. Choose one side on your elbow and go straight line. I, I don't want to see this thing. Straight line of your body. Steps up. And the swap side. Okay. 
straight. Okay, so that's 20 seconds aside, which leaves us a little bit of rest before we go again for round two. So back to cardio. If you have a skipping rope, you can do it. Three, two, one, and go. Mix it up, guys, as long as we move. There we go. Very good. Shouldn't see anybody doing nothing in this minute. Ready for bear walk. And go. Hands down. Bum up. Okay, so legs are quite straight, but we don't need to um, stiffen our knees, okay? As long as, you are, as your bum is really up high, that's fine. Few more seconds, and then quickly into your first plank side. Three, two, one. Plank. Good. I don't really care what you do with this hand as long as your body is in a straight line, okay? You can be up here, you can be in front, you can be up for balance. Totally up to you. Swap side. Just a quick 20 seconds. Okay, and rest few seconds for, well, 15 seconds for the last round coming of the warm up. Three, two, one, cardio. Three, two, one, and down. Four, your bear crawls.
Keep going, guys. That's it, bum up. Ready for side plank? Three, two, one. Side number one. Longer. Okay, quick swap. Hold it there. And relax. Good job. So that's our general warm up done. We now go into a little bit of mobility, which is going to be hamstring stretch. So we've done this before. We're going to do, well, I'm going to explain it, but uh, what we're going to do is holding five seconds, um, basically pushing against your hands or an elastic band as hard as possible, and then pulling the foot back towards you. Okay, so we do it five times per leg. So we do a single leg this time. So <clears throat> I'm gonna show you. From here, choose which leg you're going for first, and grab your toes, if you can't grab your toes, what you can use is an elastic band, a rope, whatever is gonna make you reach, okay, for some, in some ways. Uh, so from here, you go five seconds of pushing with your toes, so actually with your calf, against the fingers, so you, the whole body is kind of dragged forward, one, two, three, four, five, and then five seconds that your fingers are pulling, and your body's coming back. That makes sense. Are we all ready for? Are we ready? Are we all ready for this? So with the rope or whatever we're gonna need. If not, microphone on and say no, because I can see you. Can't. Okay. Good. So five times each leg. So choose one leg. We're going all together. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna say push and pull. Ready in three, two, one, push and pull back as strong as possible way. You should feel your calf uh, tension behind your knee or something like that. And push. Really make your body going towards your toe. Pull again. Okay, and push. Big push, big push. Really strong. And pull again. As much as you can, guys. And forward, push. Back and pulling. Push, that's the last time. And pull back, five seconds. Three, four, five. And let's swap leg. Okay, I'm starting from pushing. In three, two, one, push. And pull back strong. And push forward. Back pulling. And push. And pull. One more time. And push forward. Really strong. And pull towards you. Well done. 
Got our hammies and calf stretch done. <clears throat> should actually feel a bit of stress in your calf. Right, so we go into specific warm up now. It's going to be every 90 seconds for three times. Okay, so three, three bits of 90 seconds. We will have to do five and five single leg glute bridge. We will have to do 20 seconds per side holding a Bulgarian split squat. That's when we need a bench or a chair. And 20 seconds of fast in and out jumps, okay? So the clock will be there. But anyway, I'm gonna show you the three exercises. Single leg glute bridge. All you have to do is from here, one leg is off the ground and the other one pushes you up. Okay, so try not to make the mistake. I think you can't see me. I can't see, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sorry. So, try not to make the mistake of doing that as you come up. Okay, so straight leg that stays here, more or less at the same level. All that comes up is your hips. Okay, five at this side, five at this side. Then, with your chair or bench, you hold 20 seconds of split squats. This knee is obviously not on the ground, okay? This knee is more or less at 90 degrees. Mm -hmm. 20 seconds here, quick swap. 20 seconds here, 90 degrees. And once you've done, 20 seconds of in and out jumps. And the best way we can do it is with a little step like this. We go one, two, okay, 20 seconds. If you don't have a step, just go bunny hops back and forward for 20 seconds. Do we all, are we all, are we all okay with this? Are we good? So obviously we need to count seconds because Five and five for glute bridge, then it's gonna be 20 seconds each side of Bulgarian split squats. And you need to have your own stopwatch, or you can use this one here. Okay. And you can see that from there. I'm gonna set this for three rounds of. Ninety seconds. Everybody ready? Starting on the ground for good bridges. Ten seconds. Two, one, and go. Don't go too fast on your glute bridge. Make sure you squeeze muscles that are in use. And then 20 seconds here. Very good. Let me say fast, position yourself again there, and 20 seconds from here. Okay, takes a lot of time, so if you don't have Full 20 seconds for your little bunny hops here. All you can do is just do it until the round ends. Okay, five seconds and ready again 
four dual bridges. Let's go. Solid in that position, guys. It's not as easy. A little bit of a harder part of our warm up. Keep this 90 degree shape here. Quick transitions. And you end your round with the bunny hooks, with the in and out jumps. Anyway, round three is starting. Two, one, and go. Final round of warm up. Okay, make sure you look at the clock, stopwatch, 10 seconds. Very good. And then into your 20 seconds off. Little hopes. Just make it fast. This brings us at the end of our warm up. Oh, yeah, our warm up. We're gonna start Mekon. So, is it can be done as a pair, as a partner workout, or it can be done on your own. It's totally up to you guys. Um, so, what we're gonna do is three rounds of 42 mountain climbers. So, mountain climbers guys, make sure that we keep quality when doing this. I know we wanna go super fast in the workout, but we also want to do it right. So, plan position, okay? That's not plan, this is plan. So from here, your knee goes as far as you can in front of you, but this foot doesn't touch the ground, okay? So from here, swap, 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 swap. Every second leg, every second knee that comes up, you count a rep, okay? So if you start with your right knee, every time the left knee comes up as a leg, is a, um, is a rep. So one, two, three, four, up to 42. Okay, 42 if you want to write it down. Then 15 burpees, we know them, but doesn't mean that we, we cannot improve them. So it's only 15 for three times. It's a number that we can manage. We've done like tons of them in some workouts. 
So why don't we try to make them a little bit better today, a bit more efficient? So um, first of all, let's try to have minimal contact with the ground, with your chest. It has to touch, otherwise it's a no rep, but you don't need to <coughs> completely relax on the ground. Okay, so as you come down, touch coming up. Okay, it's almost like bouncing off the floor. And second point where you should actually focus on is that your knees should not really play a part in your burpee or the, as, as little as possible. So when we go down this way, okay, it's fine, okay, but coming up, this is very inefficient. So we should try to keep the knees off the ground, pushing away, popping up on your flat. As close as possible to that, okay? 15 burpees and a little jump at the end. And to finish the round, nine each side, um, single leg deadlift, Romanian deadlift, okay, with reach. So balance first, straight leg out, down you go, try to reach a straight line, coming up, that's a rip. Nine on one leg before you can go to the nine on the other leg. Um, obviously, it's not gonna be uh, super hard to do deadlifts without the weight. So if you want to add the weight, that's fine. If you have a heavy dumbbell, or two heavy dumbbells, and you still want to do single leg deadlifts with the dumbbells, you obviously don't need to go ahead, okay? But that works the same. That's the only thing I can think of in terms of making it harder. Um, either way, please balance, okay? Don't just rush through the lips. Like, that's not gonna be an exercise, it's not gonna be helpful, okay? Right, are we ready? Uh, Our, yes. It's really 84 mountain climbers in total, isn't it? Is uh, 40, well, yeah, yeah. Yeah, because it ran in one, two, three, four, it's one, two, yeah. three, so it's 84. Yeah, yeah. Nice. There's no rest in between rounds, no? If you want, but there's no prescribed rest. If you feel you need to. Uh, yeah, so if um, anybody wants to do it as a partner, Oh, right. fine. Okay. Right. I will not put a time cut because I have no idea how long this is going to take. I'm honest. It doesn't seem too long, but uh, because of that, we can actually um, make it really explosive and make sure that we really push really, really hard. Okay. So, are we ready? Just gonna set 30 minutes up. 42 mountain climbers or 84 if you count each knee. That's how we start. 10 seconds. Four, three, two, one. Let's go.
If you don't have weights, hands in front of you, straight arms. Very good. Steady hips on your mountain climbers. How many rounds is it about? Three rounds. Guys, get those 15 burpees smashed and broken. Push yourself. It's not a lot of reps to do. Come on. Try not to stay on your knees on your way up. Toes stay engaged on the ground on your burpees. Yep. Good, James. Don't smash the weight on the ground. Light touch. Yes.
That's it, Scott. Well done. There you go. Still a lot of arms in our burpees. Can you try to get your hands in front of you, Jackie? It's hurting my back a little, that's why I'm doing it with my hands to the ground. No problem. Nice, Scott. Remember, it's a burpee, so I'm expecting a little jump. All right, okay. Come on, guys, get it done. That's it, don't give up, come on, almost there. Well done, Jackie. Good, good reps.
Nice, Scott. Keep that balance. Come on. Straight back, straight back. It's okay. Keep fighting for it. Come on. Nice. Well done, guys. Woo! Beautiful job. You done, Scott? I can hear you. Good. So, that's the mech done. Done. Nice and quick. Hopefully intense. We now, if you want, going into the accessory part of the workout, which is going to be three reps of five of glute bridge workouts. So, this is how it works. We go into our glute bridge starting position. Yeah. Lips up. Walk up. 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 Uh, just nice and slow, make sure that your legs go almost to full extension. Coming up, small steps, that's one rep. Okay, we do it nice and slow. Five times, take a little bit of rest, three sets. Okay, whenever you're ready, come on the ground and let's do it. So the idea is small and slow steps, nice and controlled, okay? If we do it fast, I mean, kind of works, but not as good. Mm -hmm. Hips up all the time. Up, 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 up. Good. Right. Really good. Well done. Don't let your hips sink into a comfortable position. You should always consciously keep them a bit higher than your comfort zone, okay? Very good. Two. Once you've done five, just take a little bit of rest and we do the next set of five. So it should feel, you should feel in your lower back, in your back, okay, in your hamstrings.
No problem, Finley. What's that? Oh yeah, it's a little man lifting weights. So, once you've done your three sets, guys, no rush if you're still doing it, no problem. Don't make it faster than it should be right now. Um, this is it. This, are, this is our session done. So, well done, everybody. Nice hour. Yes, Val.